Hi, I'm going to show you how to set up this Curio, I believe that's how it's pronounced, camera. A lot of people seem to find it difficult to set these up. Uh, however, I have figured out exactly what you need to do uh, to set it up correctly. The first thing I'm going to do is tell you what it comes with. It comes with the camera, it comes with a USB cord, and it comes with an outlet to, uh, to pl uh, a plug to plug into your outlet. Uh, I'm, because I'm in the U.S., I'm using a U.S. plug. Uh, it only, uh, as far as I know, uh, you have to choose when you buy them which plug you need. It also comes with this. I don't, but I'm not going to use this for anything. Uh, so here's the proper way to set this up. And I'm only going to set this up using my computer. I'm not going to plug it into an outlet. First thing you, you want to do is you want to plug it in. And I'll plug it right into my computer. Then you're going to wait for it to set itself up. Okay, now that it's set up, what you want to do, you should have already downloaded the app, and I'll show you exactly which app. It's this eHome app. You press the eHome app, and you see I've already got some cameras set up. What you're going to do is hit the plus sign to add the device. The one you want to use is the QR code connect. You press the QR code. press the press reset button for five seconds until your hearing reset succeeded. Now it tells you to press the, the reset button. The reset button is back here. You press this. You, you heard reset succeeded. Now you let it go. It shows voice prompt heard. You click that. Then what you're going to do is you're going to make sure that your internet is put in here plus your password. We'll have to wait for it to set itself up again. Now, connect Wi-Fi, and there's your QR code. QR code towards camera lens. Now, and keep QR code about the first thing, away from lens. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to be about seven inches or so away from the lens. And what you're going to hear uh, is she's going to say that the password is accepted. But just because the password is accepted, you don't want to move it. You want to keep it there until it actually connects. And you'll see that on here. So what we'll do is we'll show the QR code to the camera. And you kind of got to either move it back a little bit or move it forward. Now she said receiving the password, you stay right there. Right 
network connection succeeded. Now you see it added the camera. And there's the camera that it added. And we'll lower the volume because the camera's right next to us. And then we'll also make it bigger so you can see it. And there you go. And that is how you set this camera up. I appreciate everybody watching. And uh, like, share, and subscribe. Uh, more videos to come.